welcome guys to the latest homebrew highlights and this is a special one it's a 30th anniversary edition for the atari lynx thanks to atari gamer and a bunch of talented people we got some new games so let's play the first growing ties i am looking forward to this Okay, so press button. Let's uh, let's do that. Let's uh, press the button and go forward and see what we got here. I've got no idea what this game is about. It seems to have some people with ties in it. Okay, I can start level select. That's pretty cool. So I can already select something. Okay, level one. Okay, so I've got to put ties on people. No! <laughs> what have I done? Oh! Right, okay, I got you. I got, I got what we're doing here. Okay, so I have to have the right tie adjustment for each person. By the looks of it. Oh, he looks happy. So that must have done... Okay, oh, you're right, I got two in a row. No, it didn't go so well with that one. <laughs> or that one. Hmm. Alright, so it looks like you have to make the right tie for the right people. And this machine, I don't have any control over the tie machine, but I do have control, there we go, over the... Oh, okay. Ah, okay, so I just passed that level. Level 1 complete. Not bad. New record, so you can keep your uh, high scores there. Oh, I've gone back to the level select menu, have I? Maybe I should have pressed that continue button. Did I do the wrong thing? Oh, hang on a minute. It's A and B. Oh, I see. Okay, gotcha. Alright, so you can select your level or you can just go straight on to the next challenge. That's very cool. Um, I do like that because um, it has that uh, that Lexus style um, level select feature, which that's another aftermarket title that's come out on the links. But this one, of course, this uh, homebrew game was created by Dr. Ludos, as he is called. <laughs> Just seeing how long the time machine can go. Oh, there we go. Here's a happy one. Um, and uh, this was for the uh, great tournament that was held by Atari Gamer for the 30th anniversary Atari Lynx. Oh, there's a combo. Atari Lynx competition. Uh, game designing competition. And uh, this is the first entry that I'm featuring on Homebrew Highlights. And it's a cracker. Uh, this is really well done. Uh, I'm loving this. I'm kind of firing off the uh, ties pretty rapidly here because I want to see what's next. I think probably if I spent a bit more time concentrating, I'd get a better score here. But at least at this stage, uh, I'm just seeing how I go in the levels. So my score is 115 at this stage, doing okay, but I probably could spend more time here. I wonder if I'm going to get a high enough score to advance. <laughs> he doesn't look too happy. He's happy. And i got one little guy left. Okay, let's see. Uh, not so good. Ah, uh, but it's enough to get me through. That's all right. Okay. A different tie colour. Can I control that then? I guess I can. And when is that going to matter? Um, it's all green ties at the moment. Um, no one seems to be complaining. Does that mean he needs a green one? Okay. Oh, that was dreadful. <laughs> Not happy. Okay. Not doing too well here. I, I think I need to slow down. But still, as I say, I just want to explore the game and the features here. And there's a lot of variety here. The levels do have a different focus. Graphics are great. The sound is good. There's combos to get. 
What's not to like? <laughs> All right. There's a red tie. It looks like uh, you can change colors. That's very cool. Nah, he didn't like his tie. <laughs> That's better. I don't think my score's looking too good on this level. I, don't, I think this may be me bombing out. Uh, we'll see. Yeah, no, I didn't quite get there. Hmm. Maybe I should just explore some different levels. Let's go for um, level 8. Oh, target of 220 and rapid fire, is it? Whoa. Oh, this is awesome. Oh, this is, you can see how um, you need to practice and really get your skill level up, but it's, it's as much a visual game um, as anything else. Um, it's very hard to classify this, to be honest, as a, as a game, because it's, it's not really a puzzler. It's, uh, it's not really an action game. It's a simulator of some kind. But that's what I like about it. It's very different. It's very unique. There's nothing really like this on the links at all. And that can only be a really good thing. Oh, there's a happy one. I'm not going to be getting 220. Oh, he wants a red tie. Oh, I got purple as well. Nah, it's not happening for me. But that's okay. I'm loving it. Hmm. Well, I think I'm going to leave it there, guys. Um, I don't think I'll explore any more. But well done, Dr. Ludos. I'm looking forward to the next games. Ciao.